I'm showing you how to get motion blur for Minecraft. So to get it, you want to head over to Skier's Motion Blur official GitHub page. This is going to be linked down in the description below. Here we can go over to the releases tab and grab Motion Blur 2.0.jar. Alternatively, you can also get it on Skier's official website. This is going to be linked down in the description below. Now, for this Motion Blur, you do need Forge installed for 1.8.9. Uh, if you don't have this yet, or you're not sure where to get it, then I will link it down in the description below. Anyways, as you can see in my downloads here, I have the Motion Blur, which is great. And I can press on Windows and R at the same time. In the box that pops up, you want to type in App Data, hit Enter, or click on OK. Then in this area here, you want to go into the folder called Roaming.Minecraft, and then scroll down a little until you find the Mods folder. And you can simply put now motion blur inside of the mods folder over here. And that is that. We can now close up both of these. All right, with the mod in your mods folder, you want to once again make sure you have Forge 1.8.9 selected. And then you can simply launch Minecraft. You'll notice it might install something called Essential over here. And that is exactly what you want to happen. Um, basically, it requires something called the Essential mod. But it's actually going to install it automatically for you. So you don't even have to do that. Oh, and it actually says it as well. Essential mod has been installed because its libraries are required by Motion Blur. So that's obviously fantastic. Anyways, we can now just head into um, a single player world, for example, here, and I'll show you how this works. All right, so upon loading into Minecraft here, you won't really notice anything different just yet. And, um, well, that makes sense because Motion Blur hasn't actually been enabled just yet. Uh, so over here you want to open up the chat and then type in slash motion blur just like this that's going to be the command you use to access this uh, and you can type in any value for example one that's the lowest value we can select and now the motion blur has been enabled um, you might notice something you might not I actually think it's it's quite noticeable um, anyways the highest value you can choose is 10 so we can try that as well for example so slash mo I mean 7 it's uh, 7 slash motion blur 7 and well now uh, if you're not noticing this then that's just insane uh, this is obviously kind of wild I'm not sure who would uh, like genuinely play like this but oh well uh, it's cool and it, it, it at least shows that the mod does actually work for all the uh, non-believers out here uh, anyways we can of course also type in slash motion blur zero again and that is going to disable it for us if you want to do that and of course you can change it at any point in time uh, should also works when cheats are disabled because it's not uh, it doesn't rely these this command at least doesn't rely on them uh, anyways for right now though basically that was that simple enough right uh, for right now though thank you ever so much for watching and I do of course hope to see you again in the next one bye bye